59. I'm one way from being halfway. What? And that cat just looks like a pickle. Hello and welcome to the next episode of Super Mario Galaxy. The final version will be 100%. Last time we have started, finished up Freeze Flame Galaxy. There we go. I said it right that time. Just can't really say it that quickly. And started on Dusty Doom Galaxy. And we're gonna finish it up and hope we finish up the bedroom dome. Yeah. Die chicken! Yeah, there's no way to get that chicken to fall in this quicksand. In here. See that? That's gonna be. See that? Now we're. See, I want. Yeah, so. Yeah, most of this. If we get first part of the level, we're gonna. We already seen because. Front. Camera seems a little out of focus though. I'll get that up. Oh. You're right. Now, I might as well just do the. You know, just standing up here. Yeah, you know, oddly enough, this thing looks like it's rising, but no. This this part here is falling, and a star bit made out of vents there. We were over there last time. Yeah, we were over right around where my pony was last time. And the re. Now, the reason why. Yeah, and if you notice back 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 in that area over there, there were those bull bills were there were a whole bunch of dry bones, and you can't kill them. They j it's just that that you have to get lower bull bill to a uh, lower bull bill into a cage that has a stock that has one of those that has one of those though it was invincibility stars. And you, and you have to kill, try to kill them all with that one. But it's not mandatory, mandatory per se. It's just optional, just to make it a little easier. Right. He's the. Uh, it's actually a really nice view, view up from up here. There you get flying off into this direction. Now, we already went down on that, you did the secret mission, so let's smash this thing, and keep an eye on the thing, that thing over there where my corner is, that, that one we were planning we were just on. I don't know if you saw it though, it rose back up. That's interesting. And hey, a pokey is back. <laughs> yeah, which I did, they made it raise back up for a reason. Now, and if you notice, we're all on the same point, this planet that we, this planet from Good Egg Galaxy, it's returned. Interesting. It's like an o oasis, is, or something. So what you want to do is bring a coconut up to this planet, and what you want to do is do the same thing, hit it, hit the coconut with the po, straight into the pokey. So you might want to, wait, oh, there it is, I saw it here. So you want to try to make sure you have the pokies already out, ready to be hit. And then you want to do that, or spinach one. And woo, fly very close to some of those, that, those things, yeah. We managed to land on the top of this thing. Some reason, well, upside, the camera's just pointing us upside down for some unexplained reason. And there's the underside of that, the one, uh, one with the secret mission is. And you, you want to jump down off the, like that. I want you to get a good perspective from this right, from this right side up angle. For the, you guys might want to turn your heads upside down here. Here because, well, the camera's going to be upside down. And this part here part, is probably the hardest part in the mission. You can get... The reason why I say hard is because, well, you'll see in a minute. Hype! Where's this go? <laughs> Couldn't have made a door there. If you want, yeah, you want to destroy those crates. You're gonna be going on in this 2D section, even though you can move in 3D. And then, oh no, this point's rising. So you, yeah, if you get crushed, you'll get dead. You're dead. Uh, so this point can be kind of hard. But. But it seems to get at least the camera automatically scrolls, scrolls for turns for you, so you don't have to turn it for it yourself. And 
and it makes no sense to me why this plot, plot thing here is just sinking, even though the tower on the top half of this thing was rising up, was coming up when this thing was still standing. And it kind of, that's weird. But the good news is that when you reach the top, like this point here, you will, the, you'll be okay. The reason why I say okay is because the sand automatically stops. So that is nice. Let me just try to aim this down a bit. Maybe I should do this. Okay, it might, it might work. We have money running in. Yeah, I'll just leave it like that. Yeah, we haven't ran into the Punctual comment for this yet. We might see it right now. Yep, there it is. I was wondering what machine. Wondering what speed, speed run this is. We'd, we'll find out in a second. Uh, a sand blast speed run. It's basically just blasting through the sand speed run. And plus, we'll get to see a route that we didn't go on. Which is kind of like a shortcut, which helps out a lot on this mission, version of this mission. It, and we get to see some differences. There were star bits there. And yeah, personally, I never really go back to play the Frank Shoe comics. I mean, like, the only few ones. Oh, wow. Fuck, got them all at one spin. The only ones that are Frank Shoe comics that I will play a second time I'm, are the. Probably the purple coin ones. And maybe I'll play. I don't know, the, no, the Dale Devil ones or the Cosmic Mario ones a second time. But ones like this. Not too much. They'd rather not go through something with a time limit. Yeah, then. I didn't. I didn't. Come on. And yeah, no dry bones is there. That's nice. We have to. Again, we have to collect all these star ships right here. No. Nah. Come on. Yeah. We already want bonus. I don't know what you're talking about for this level. Except that we're going to be coming to a new section that we haven't seen yet in a minute here. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Yeah, this is it. Again, place these time again. These time limits are not too steep. You can, you can be. You'll have like a minute or so left, and you'll be okay. Last time we went on the orange route, now we're gonna actually go on the green air route. Well, not green route, just an area with the green air route. See? A pipe! Watch this in here. Hey, hey I'm, get, I'm getting a sense of deja vu here. This this was also in the original mission, but I just didn't want it. I wanted to show it off for you. Yeah, see, um, this music is familiar. We did this in Good Egg Galaxy. This reuses a few gimmicks from Good Egg. This galaxy reuses a few gimmicks from Good Egg Galaxy. That small planet where the coconuts were on. On to get the pokey. That was um, that wasn't there. That was in Good Egg Galaxy. Pokey was in Good Egg Galaxy. See, okay. see that thing we were just get in. With a do 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 that wasn't good at Galaxy, so it kind of uses a few things. But hey, that was that way we went was watching because it has a shortcut. And hey, we get a lot. We sweet, yeah. But we don't need to go for that a soon early part of this course again, which is nice. And plus, no tornadoes, so it makes this kind of a little harder. Yeah, well, not too much harder, but since I, because I took that shortcut that led me here. <laughs> well, well, I have, maybe have a minute and a half left. Missed one day. And we're done with this Dusty Doom Galaxy for now. But we will come back much later and see what else there is. Past 60 stars, we're more than half, we're just about halfway done with 
halfway through them from 100%. So now we're going to the, the last galaxy here, which is the minor galaxy. Honey Klein Galaxy. This is a level based around using the bee, the bee form, which a lot of people so, again, some reason don't like. See, we have to climb those honey shapes, those hexa honey hexagons with honey in them. Yeah. So, well. But uh, I kind of like this level for quite a bit. So, so yeah, we we saw a little bit of this honey climbing stuff in Honey Hive Galaxy, but but we're seeing it. It's more we're seeing more of it here. And I, and I believe we see it in a later in one more level of a galaxy. Yeah, yeah that gold coin will give you star bits. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, a few. There were certain power ups that. Something I haven't mentioned yet. There were certain power ups that will make you. That will deactivate your. Your. Your power ups if you go into it. Or this launch. I mean, go into the launch star. And I was. And yeah, they get a little. These part, part, These honey climbing levels get a little hot. Part sections get a little harder. We need to get a checkpoint in between each one. Cause see now we have these cannonball, these small meteor things coming down. Now and something else that's kind of nice is that you actually get to keep your star buds even though you die. The ones you collected before you died, so you can just keep dying until you get like ninety, a um, thousand star beds. Technically nine hundred ninety nine, but I say I'm saying a thousand because well it seems it'd be quicker to say. And now we have these. Uh, I'm these bug I'm these that we had the ground pound and honey hive galaxy. Oh, okay, I was waiting for the thing to come back. Uh, you can't ground pound these things, guys. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! 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 My goodness, didn't want to die again. Whoop. Okay, at least you move along with this thing at certain point. I should probably grab. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, you, do, you can kill these enemies if you want, but I'm not. I'm not just. I'm just giving them just to not do too waste too much time for them. So, uh, so now we have to face off with Bowser in this deal. Uh, let's look dome and then we're done with it. And of course we have the hungry little mouth eye. And this is probably my now we're coming up to probably my favorite Bowser mission mission where we faced off of Bowser in the whole game. So you know, I just quite like it. Right into the eyeball. And something else I haven't mentioned is that after you Oh, to unlock the Bowser mission, but haven't played it yet. This, mu 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 this music will start playing going. Da -da 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 it only happens after you unlock it, but ha but it, the music goes back to normal after you played it one time for the first finished it for you. And this mission involves us avoiding dark matter. Yeah, yeah, that stuff, that purple stuff there was dark matter. Don't touch this, and, and don't touch it, you'll get instantly killed. Yeah, we get, and we're getting into more gimmick where we go, well, we've seen the, all this gimmick before where we, we go upside down. You know, but now we're getting into gimmicks where we go sideways. You know, they're getting kind of creative with these levels. Yeah, whenever it comes to something like this, you want to make sure you have a wall, some in between two walls. Oh, by the way. Up here, he gets lots of coins. Yeah, 25 coins there. And now we got look, more dark matter holes there, but those dark matter holes won't, won't hurt you, kill you. They'll, you'll just fall back, back through them. Oh, and these are like very nice 
light blue things, they were dark matter matter as well, so kill. Yeah, a lot of dark matter in this level. Oh, I can't go in first person there. Yeah. Well, Alright, on we again. I wanna. And we're what, starting to go upside down again to the. To probably the trick hardest part of this level with the. Probably the hardest part of it, the level here. Do a long jump! Well. Now we're. Now we're coming to a point where we have to. It's gonna go like counterclock. We're gonna be going counterclockwise, shifting here. <laughs> oh, yeah, that, and this is the only time we actually get to see the the arrows pointing into the left. The only part in the level, oddly uh, enough. And the only time we get to see them. And don't make sure you get all onto this one. Oh man, that was close. But <laughs> and that's the last of the levels we're gonna see for a while. And what do you want? Read the use the stairs here. Oh, and that platform that we went to they'll disappear again. Another health extension. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. And I, not much detail than in the other one. Wah! <laughs> it's you! That's it, Mario! I'm gonna stomp you into space, Bert! So, basically, we're facing off of Bowser again with the same age again, but the only difference, there are some differences. Like the Fireful Planet one, it has a different look to it. He also has a Dark Matter spin. And also, I'm fin fin also forgot to mention that these point things right here, though no, those brown, oh, the, the, these brown, those brown things right there where my pointer is, you can actually make Bowser fall in, crush them to give you some side bits. Kind of nice to see. Oh, missed them. No, 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 don't get up! Don't get up! Don't get up! Ugh, that was close. Almost didn't get him though. And now he's gonna be starting to spin while he launches his fireballs. Oh yeah, right. I sh you should probably start be, be a little far from him because he's gonna be start doing this dark matter spin. Ow! I keep getting hit. But at least I can still get him. One, one more way left to go. Give me the. Oh wow, that's where I, where I was with the coin. Going there. And now I think he's gonna jump five or six times. He jumped five times. Come on, don't get me, don't get me, don't get me, don't get me! Oh, that was close. It looked like he should have got me there. Well, let's finish you off, Bowser. Let's hit you in the tail. Oh, I missed him. This dude and coming around. Boom, boom, boom. Wahaha! Not bad. I guess I'll choose. I choose the right guy to be my arch nemesis. At least you always put up a fight, but it's too. Too bad for you because my master plan is almost complete. Tough luck, Mario.
Jeez, we discovered six new galaxies. Yeah, access location is special one. What circle? Oh, that circle? That number represents the power source you need to reach the center of the universe. That number will stop. Decrease when, when with each power cell you recover. Yeah, okay, she's just telling us that we can uh, some stuff here or, uh, can do. Come to it has full power again. That's nice. And that number is there. Do I want to go to the center of the universe? Wait, I'm not ready to go. Yeah, and now we have act since we have the engine room is now powered, we can now we can now go to, to do the final but the last level of the game. And let's talk to him, Luigi. Phew, I'm beat. You're gonna have to find the rest of the power stars. So that so that confirms that Luigi won't come and re help us anymore. That's a bummer. Well not really too much. So at least he's saying somewhere safe to protect this place. That would help go to Hungry Luba. Eight hundred. I already have like more than twice. Almost, I have almost tw three times the amount you need. And since we have the engine room, we can now go on to the second floor of the Comet Observatory. We'll save that for a, for a little later. And of course, we're going up in. Flying upside down into that hole. A planet that's in the shape of a whale. And they're like, we saw you oh, no, we saw you before. You need some excitement. But now what the object what the objective is to do in this level is to open this gold treasure chest. You can't just open it with a regular shell. You need a special kind of shell. But we'll take this shell with us to go find it. We have to go into the belly of the beast. <laughs> the belly of the beast. More like belly of the whale. Or oh, bottom feeder. <laughs> yeah. Let's charge through these bricks. Jellyfish. Now, there is a shortcut to this, so let's just pull it off, try to pull it off. There we go. Took a shortcut right there. Oh, I almost went down. What do you, anyway, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to find five, some, those star shard, shards down at the bottom of this thing here, so you can, so that you can uh, get a, I think a launch star or a sling star to get up to there, to where, where the skull shell is. And then go back the way we're going right now. But I managed to take a shortcut there. Holy booze. Shouldn't we what, go take water? I don't know now. But since we got this gold shell, we can now open this chest. Captain Toad? What, does he really need that light on all the time? That would be kind of blinding to Mario. Yeah, we're gonna take it. And now we're gonna kind of end. We might end. We're gonna end things off here for a bit, but not not yet. But first, we're gonna show you one last something. That what the upper level is gonna be like. Yeah. Also, if you want to go to the final, the last level of the game, you just have to talk to Rosalina. So why don't we just push, see what the next floor level is like before we head out of here. So you want to wall jump up that, go up to this thing, and run these metal pla platforms that will lead up here. 
Also, if you fall off these platforms, you're gonna slide down to back to the first level. And you also have these platforms you those platforms here that was that spin that are similar to ones down that were green down below. And we keep going here. We can't go any further. Oop, didn't mean to do that. We can't go any further, dude. And but if you notice, there's something here. Stand here to go down. Let's see what it does. This is the, now we access a shortcut to the engine room. So it's not really too big of a shortcut, but it kind of helps. So I won't. Uh, so yeah, that is nice that they make you a quick way to get to, get to something at the top of this place, ways down to the bottom. Um, um, so now we have an easier way to get going up there. The angry reason why I say easier because we don't have to wall jump off some bookshelves to get up here. And we can go in there if we want here if we want. But we're not gonna go in here yet. We'll save that for next episode. And if uh, yeah, see if you stand here you're gonna slide off. But if you manage to miss any platform, you go back up. So I guess that so that would be probably if this episode here. Next time we will go into the engine room and discover what galaxies we have in there. So see you next time.